Hi guys, I wanted to go over something. I read in the forum concerning power bus and having a dual redundant power supply. I had originally had the power supply going one to Vortex and then one to the receiver. And what I found was there might be some interference or loop noise or a loop resonance maybe. So uh, I took the um, diagrams that were on the forum and the conversation about this went ahead and ordered a Spartan power bus micro power bus it's right here I ran wires uh, just like in the diagrams I used the SV5 port and uh, the data port for the data pod so I ran that through and now I have dual power coming into the vortex so my redundancy is proper and without this way I, uh, I take away all the uh, loop noise and all of that frequency or that that noise that could interfere with the transmission from my radio to the receiver and by doing that this is a true Spartan Heli data pod on board with holder vortex nano Spartan data bus micro there it is now I'm feel really secure about this having the two power sources coming in that's just great I'm here at the field here I'm gonna fly the Magnum to today the Magnum's gonna get flown and I got my little beater here my little 500 She's awesome, actually, she flies so perfect. You just gotta love that Spartan gyro. And then we'll finish it off with the eight, uh, with the 700 Dominator top. All the 800 goodies on her. All right, this is a great day at the flying field here in Orange County, California, Southern California. Peace.